Hey guys, welcome back to today's video. If you're new here, I'm Jamie V. Thanks for stopping by. So today we're gonna to be doing a little bit of a different video. I'm going to be doing a small PR unboxing slash first impression slash review for you guys so you can kind of see what I've gotten in the mail and what I think of the things that I've gotten. But before we get into the video, just make sure you hit the subscribe button and the bell next to it so you can be instantly notified when I upload, become part of the hive. I do so many cool videos, you don't wanna miss out. So without further ado, let's get into the video. All right guys, so a couple of things before we get into the video. One, obviously I don't really have any makeup on today. I have lipstick on and I have mascara and that is about it because one, I'm doing a PR unboxing and I know there's like skincare and stuff like that in there. So I wanna be able to put it on my skin without like kind of having to worry about my makeup and all that jazz. And two, sometimes it's just really normal or fun, I guess, feeling to come on camera and just kind of be real with you guys and you guys see me for who I really am. I do not wear makeup every single day. I'm not beating my face and walking out with these gorgeous lashes and eyebrows every day. It just doesn't happen. So I wanna kinda just be able to be real with you guys when I'm doing like PR unboxings or like chit chats and stuff like that. But I had to put a lipstick on and I had to put mascara because sometimes without those two basic essential needs, I will fall apart. But <laughs> the second announcement is obviously one big announcement you guys have been waiting for. My channel has reached 750 subscribers and I wanna thank you all so, so much. Especially all of you very active subscribers. I really, really appreciate all the love and kindness you guys show me. I'm just trying to build a little community here and you guys have really helped me out with that and just given me a whole lot of positive vibes, which I absolutely love. So I wanna be able to give back to you. So the winner, of the 750 giveaway is Amber Borst. I will go ahead and I'll comment down below and pin it. And I will also comment on the other video of when I started the giveaway and give her about 24 hours to reach out to me. My Instagram is below, Amber, if you wanna go ahead and DM me there or email me if it's easier. Um, if she does not reach out to me, I will go ahead and pick somebody else from the list of comments. If you did not win, please don't take this to heart. Please don't be upset. There will be plenty of other giveaways on my channel. I don't want anyone's feelings hurt. If I had the money to buy and give you all something for being so freaking awesome, I totally freaking would, but I just, I can't. So I had to pick one person and I don't want anyone to be upset about it. The next thing that I wanna talk about is I will be having another giveaway coming up soon. So just make sure you stay tuned because I'm not announcing it yet, but I will be within the next week or two. Also guys, I want to do a truthful YouTuber video, but without your guys' questions, I really can't do that. If you're watching this and you're an awesome subscriber of mine or a new subscriber or whatever you are, go ahead and leave me a question below. Something you really wanna know about YouTubers or about me, about my experience, about my life. So go ahead and comment that question below and it'll be featured in my truthful YouTuber video. So with all of that, <laughs> Let's give Amber Boris a round of applause because she won the giveaway and let's move on to the video. All right, so the first thing I got is it's not, a lot of this is not makeup, it's beauty related, which is kind of my whole shabam is just to be like beauty related. It doesn't necessarily have to be makeup, it can be skincare, hair care, all of that good stuff. And speaking of hair care, <laughs> my hair finally looks good. Is that poofy and crazy? Thank you to Cassandra, my hairstylist. If you guys live in the Maryland area, go ahead and reach out to me on Instagram and I'll let you know where she is so you can go to her salon. I don't wanna say it on camera, obviously, because I don't want some strange weirdo to find me and you know, like kill me or something, I don't know. But <laughs> So the first thing I have, or that was sent to me is, it is a brand called Not Pot, and I think this is kind of funny. It is a dietary supplement and they sent it in this cute little bag. It's like a canvas bag, which I really, really love. I got two bottles of them. They are little gummies and they contain hemp extract. Mm, hemp extract. So they're supposed to be like CBD oil, or not CBD oil, CBD gummies. Um, they taste okay, they smell okay, they're really cute. They're just like little white bears. Um, and I will kind of give you a rundown of what they say it's for. And I do know that a one-time purchase is $39.99 for one bottle. So for the two, it's $80. Okay. So this is a daily strawberry flavored hug for your endo 
endocannabinoid system, 10, 10 milligrams of organically grown full spectrum hemp plus 100% vegan ingredients equals the chillest, cleanest CBD polar bear gummy on the block. Our clinical strength CBD gummies are non-psychoactive, aka they will not get you high, and they're tested by top scientists, medical doctors, and universities at the forefront of medical cannabis. I have seen that it says that it's good for like anxiety, kind of just like stress, um, good for sleep, pain, your mood, try to put you in a good vibe. Um, I've been taking them for I want to say about a week or so maybe. I haven't really felt any different. I have like, when it comes to like stress and anxiety, I'm like here, you can't even see me anymore. I'm up here. <laughs> um, so I just, I don't know that this isn't working or maybe it just takes a little bit longer because with any vitamin or dietary supplement, it does take a little while for you to kind of, your body to regulate it and you just have to keep taking it and keep taking it. So I am going to keep doing it just to see. Um, I've tried it at nighttime. It doesn't really help me sleep. And I've taken it in the morning to kind of see if it kind of will like chill me out because sometimes I get real stressed with like everything, work, my second job, YouTube, all that good stuff that I'm doing and never ever stop. <laughs> so um, I just think that it was really nice of them and thank you Not Pop, for sending this to me, but it's just not really my kind of thing. Um, I don't mind vitamins and I'm going to keep trying to see if it works so I'll kind of give you guys like a update to let you know whether or not it really did anything but as of right now I haven't really felt a difference and again like I said I've been doing it for about a week or so so if you are any on any kind of gummy like that go ahead and comment below and let me know if or when it started to actually help you all right and so the next one is in this envelope okay so this is I hope you like them <laughs> So this one is from Averell Cosmetics, and it is little face masks, which I love sheet masks, so this is super awesome. Um, the first one I got was Herbal Infused Tea Extract. I'll go ahead and try to get that shininess out of your way. All right, so looking at their Instagram, um, it actually looks like it's attached to Amazon, which is kind of weird, but okay. So for these right here, this is the Acne Cover Patch, and it's a variety of sizes. There's 40 individual um, patches in here. They're made with tea tree and calendula oil. Calendula, yeah, that. I'm not really sure how to pronounce that, but you get the gist. Um, it blends with your skin, protects from dirt, resealable package. They are like these really cute like little dots here. So you have six pieces of small ones, 24 piece of medium and six piece of large. So it says that they can be used for covering acne and protecting from dirt. I don't think it helps like get rid of it or anything. I'm not really sure, but this is 850 on Amazon. And now let's look for the sheet masks. All right. So I looked on their link that they have on Instagram and it doesn't it really just has these on there for 850. It doesn't have like the sheet masks, so I really don't know how much they are, but I did get three of them sent to me. So this one is the Herbal Infusion Tea Tree Extract. Okay, so the other one I got was a Herbal Infusion, um, I don't really know how to pronounce this, I'm not gonna try to butcher it, but it's C-I-C-A Extract, so if you know how to pronounce that, please let me know below. And then the last one is a Herbal Infusion with Rosehip Seed Extract. So these seem really nice. I'm gonna go ahead and open one of them up. It's gonna be this one, just to kind of test out. Oh my God, did you see that? It like squirted across the table, across the room. There's so much stuff in here. So from feeling it, it is, it is really drippy. So be careful of that. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and put it on my hand and just kind of see what's going on. So it doesn't really have a smell, so that's nice and it is really moisturizing my hands, which is nice, but I guess we'll kind of have to see once they dry. It's kind of like, really has no smell at all. It's kind of weird. But so obviously for those of you who know how to use a sheet mask, you open it up and you place it on your face. It literally has cut out of like eyes and stuff. But for those of you who do not, this is how you do it. And then you place it on here for 10 to 15 minutes and kind of just rub it in afterwards. Um, you never wash it off. You just let it sit, chill out, read a book, watch a movie, 
it does come with a lot of stuff inside. So that one I really, really like. It's not sticky. It's very hydrating on my skin. So I'm really excited to use these on my face. This one, I don't really know um, what it does or if I'll ever use it. I don't really have acne. Unfortunately, I am blessed with that, but maybe I'll just put it in a giveaway later on. Okay, so the next one is from GYV Miso American. I think it's Miso American Beauty. I hope I'm saying that right. If not, if the company is watching, please, please, please comment below. Oh. And I got a certificate for $10 off, and it says, with every purchase, a GYV we give, oh, give, GYV, okay. With every purchase, we, G, we give a portion of our proceeds to charity. Our passion for Miso American staples, voices, flavors, and fragrances will guide our efforts to find and support organizations who are nutri nurturing and improving the communities that inspire us. Current charity. Fondo, mm -mm. I'm going to put it up because I cannot pronounce that and I'm going to ruin it and it's going to be really bad. Can you see that? I'm not going to do that. So that inspires. I think that's like really cute that they put a lot of their proceeds to charity. I really love that about companies. It's all about giving back. And this is a smaller brand, I think. So I think that's really awesome that they do that. So the first thing I, it looks like I got, oh, a candle. Immerse, refresh, adorn. So this is in Jamaica. So this one is, our sources of inspiration are the four staples of Mesoamerican traditions, maize, squash, bean, and chili. Ooh, oh my God. So it's so pretty, first of all, okay. And then it is obviously just your regular candle, but it smells so good. Oh my God, that smells so good. So this candle does retail for $35. It smells really good, so I'm hoping that when it burns, it smells just as good. So moving along, I also got a Dahlia hand cream, protect, nourish, and renew. So this hand cream retails for $24. Oh, that's cute. It kind of unfolds. Oh, it's so pretty. So I love pink. <laughs> so let's give this a smell. Ooh, it isn't like a lid it twists open and comes out that way. Oh my God, that smells so good. Ooh, all right, let's see what we got here. Okay, it's not sticky, it's not thick. Oh, that smells so good. Oh. So a little bit would go a long way because I'm not gonna lie, it is a little bit strong, but I think that it smells really really nice it looks like they gave me a sample one of mango and that smells so yummy I could eat that like I could very well eat that and it's just another hand cream is what I'm assuming thank you so much um give me so American beauty I don't know if it's give or GYV please mm -hmm. don't kill me please ignore the wet stain I dropped my water while drinking it so the next one is a beauty, a makeup product. This is from Beauty Vault, and they sent me quite a few lipsticks. Now this one I have tried and I do love. I actually have one on today. It is the O Olivia, and I'm a big fan. So this one says, thank you for trying our liquid lipsticks. Through purchases, we are able to donate 5% of the sales to domestic violence victims, one in four. We hope you love our, pro oh my God. I think that's amazing. Oh my God. Okay, so their Instagram is Beauty Vault um, with an E on the end of Vault. And I think that that's absolutely amazing. I think it's like really sweet that they do that because domestic violence is really big across the world. And I think that it's super awesome that they donate 5% to them. So kudos to you, Beauty Vault. So they reached out to me and they were like, listen, we know you don't like all that packaging or that extra packaging. So we really just wanna send you one so people can see what it comes in and then the rest will just be put into the shipping package, which I think is absolutely phenomenal because so much weight is unnecessary so I really love that they did that so I did find them back on Instagram it looks like they are a little bit of a smaller company they are cruelty free and they ship worldwide so that's good I'm going to their page to see how much it costs okay 
All right, so they sent me five different liquid lipsticks that retail for $12.50 a piece, which I think is a phenomenal price. This is what you get when you actually purchase from them. It comes in this cute little vault of a box and it holds the lipstick right here, which I think this is so cute. I'm, I'm just glad that they only sent me one though because it's like, I, what would I do with five of these? It's unnecessary, but I think that this is super freaking cute. So I actually wore the one that was in the box and it is in Bow Babe and it is this pretty like brown orange color like it definitely has hints and undertones of orange i wore it so i go to work at my day job from it's a little bit more reddish too from 5 a.m to 2 30 p.m okay and i wore this lipstick and that did not have to, to reapply it at all like i could not i looked in the mirror at like noon after i'd eaten breakfast i'd eaten lunch and i'm like are you kidding me like it literally a little just the slightest had faded off on the inside but it was phenomenal so this one is bow bay i think that's what they're called this one is bow babe this one is the one i have on right now which is oh olivia and i think it is beautiful it the one the only thing about this one is i did have to do two applications because it was just a sh just a smidge too light for my liking but it's lightweight it's not very dry and they I could not believe they lasted as long as they did like I just could not believe it and this one is earthy Emma okay so this one is earthy Emma and then we have Maisie Maya which is a super cute pink one. Oh my I just I love these they're so pigmented they feel so comfortable to wear they dry down fairly fast which i really really like so that is Maisie maya and then the last one is very venus which is a deeper red and i will actually swatch it right above the other red so you can see the difference all right so the red ones and or the reddish and the reddish orange kind of seem a little bit patchy but they're not terrible you go over one more time and it's totally fine so this is very venus look at these colors i absolutely love them i did not think i was gonna like them just because they seemed i'm not gonna lie to you kind of like off the wall like some random company but i'm telling you these were phenomenal i really like how they feel they're lightweight like it doesn't feel like I have anything on my freaking lips and they lasted all day for $12.50 freaking I can't wait I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna get more of them because I really really do like those the last but not least is actually going to be this humongous box that I sit sideways to show you guys because it's huge like this thing is big it's bigger than my head so we're gonna open it up it is from pixie pixie it's from Pixie, and this is Skin Treats. Love the skin you're in. So it opens up, and you have all that's in here. So you simply spin the dial, and then let the relaxation begin. Okay, so it came with this cute little spinner, and you can kind of like pick which one you're gonna use for the day or whatnot. It came with a cute little um, like cloth, and it's actually really freaking soft, so I cannot wait to use that on my face. So the first thing that I did try was the D-Puff. So it says D-Puff right here. And this is the Detoxify, and it's spelled I-E-Y-E, -E, which I think is super freaking cute. So I'll turn back around to show you guys. So it comes with a lid. I did try these. Ugh. And... So they're just these little eye things, and I'm actually going to put them on my eye right now. It came with a spoon right here to kind of like lift them up, but they kind of stick together. So it's very, it can kind of be very hard to use these. And the only thing that I would have to say is they are very, very slimy. Like they're like overly slimy. They don't smell bad. They really don't have a smell to them. Um, I used them the other day and my son used them too. And it's supposed to get rid of like puffy eyes. So like I would use them in the morning instead of at nighttime. And they're just like, they're really comfortable and they feel really well. And let's all make fun of the fact that I now have eye mask on. So if you notice, like I just had to do something real quick. So I was moving around. They slide like down your face. So I would just suggest that like, 
you kind of just lay down if you have them on. Um, but I think those are pretty freaking cool. Okay, so the Detoxify retail for $24. And I'm gonna go ahead and pop them off. So when you're done, you pop them off and you just kind of like rub in the excess. But the problem is again, they're so freaking slimy. And then I'm gonna just pat it off because, oh, okay. Okay, towel that wants to freaking fade on my face. What is happening? All right, so moving right along to my second favorite are more sheet masks because I freaking love them. These are the Glow Glycolic Boost. Um, it has glyco glycolic acid. I'm having a hard time there. Ginseng and witch hazel. Brighten infused sheet mask. Now that I'm reading it, it has witch hazel and the last time I used witch hazel, it broke my skin out, which is kind of weird because it's supposed to be really good for your skin. So I'm gonna kind of be a little bit iffy about wearing those. But let me get the price of those for you guys. So the glow masks are $10, but you get three of them. So you get three in one and it is $10. The T-Zone, and this is the peel off mask. I did use this one. Um, so it comes like this and it is like a green, almost like a iridescent green color. And you just obviously put a thinner coat on, let it dry, peel it up. Um, I didn't find that it was painful. However, it you had to put more on. Like it says a thin layer, but I really had to put a lot on to actually get it to peel up the second time I did it. However, it really did make my skin look really nice. All right, so this one retails for $22. And then one more which is detox and this is the glow mud mask i actually did not use this one and it says 15 minute facial this is pore cleansing glow revealing mask this one is pretty cool and i think you're supposed to use this one in the evening let me get it open for you these nails are ridiculous all right so let's pour a little something something oh so it's like a mud mask so apply a thin layer on a clean skin, avoiding the eye area, let dry for 15 minutes, and then rinse off thoroughly and pat dry. Use to two to three times a week. So this one does have a little bit of a scent and it does come with that like gray, it's like a mud mask is basically what it is. So it feels very nice. Um, it's not very thick or sticky or gross and I'm ruining this brand new white cloth they gave me. So uh, yeah, there's that. <laughs> All right, so I really do like this one and I'll be excited to try it. And I will always, if you guys wanna know like the detail or more in depth of any of these, you can always comment below which one and then I will come back and let you know. So the last, pro <laughs> the last product out of this humongous box is the peel and polish. So this is a salon peel treatment made easy at home. You can use it in the morning or the afternoon. I am not gonna open this um, because I'm probably going to give it away. I cannot do any kind of resurfacing, retinas, anything that deals with a chemical peel of some sort, I really just can't do because it, it really irritates and upsets my skin. So I will probably either put this in a giveaway or just give it to a close friend or family member, but I will get the price for you for this one. So this is the peel and polish. So the peel and polish retails for $24. I'm pretty sure that this will be really, really great um, for anyone who does not have super sensitive skin, but you have super sensitive skin like I do, you need to stay clear of things like this because the enzymes and stuff that go into your skin to exfoliate instead of a physical exfoliator can really kind of mess up with the balance of everything going on on your face. So that is it for my itty bitty little PR unboxing. I hope you guys liked it. It's a new kind of video. I wanted to be like chill with you guys, be real with you guys and that kind of stuff and mix it up because I just, I like to do all kinds of different stuff. I am primarily a review channel, but I do like to kind of throw different things in there. So if there's anything you guys want to see, make sure you give me a comment below and I will make sure I get it out for you. All right. I'll see you on the next one. Bye.